The Fortnite Chapter 1 Battle Pass just got revealed. And on today's video, we're having a look at each and every single one of these skins and checking out the new map and all the free rewards that you can claim in the new battle pass. So, if you want to get the new battle pass, then hit that thumbs up and that subscribe button. Because the new battle pass is coming out on 3rd of November on this month. And with this, we're actually going to have 50 total rewards. And this battle pass is going to be called the OG Pass. The first skin we're going to be having a look at is going to be the Heartbringer Armor Omega Rock. This is going to be a combination of Omega and Ragnarok himself combined all together in one skin. And obviously this skin is also going to have an edit style which is going to look like this. But the best part about this is that this battle pass is actually going to have a ton of free rewards. If you actually have a look down here, if you own the battle pass, you will get a loading screen, a pickaxe, a glider and some more V-Bucks. But if you look below, these two items which are in grey, that means even if you don't have the battle pass, you will still get a free glider and 100 more V-Bucks. And also on the other page, we have got a free loading screen, a free wrap, we have also got some free V-Bucks, a free back bling and some more V-Bucks to go along with this skin. And also we have got this really awesome emote which is gonna be the little longboard emote cause obviously we had the viking village on top next to polar peak and that's why we have got this awesome emote to go along with the awesome skin. Cause the next skin which has been revealed is gonna be the renegade links. Renegade Raider was one of the most OG skins in Fortnite Chapter 1 Season 1 and well, they mixed it up with the Link skin all the way from Chapter 1 Season 7. And now, we have this amazing skin and this skin itself comes up with a lot of free rewards. We have got a free loading screen and a free wrap which will be free for everyone but on top of that, we have got a bag bling, we have got a banner, a glider and some more free V-Bucks. Now this skin also comes up with an edit style which is gonna be the Dark Storm Renegade Links. And as you can see this is gonna be the edit style for the skin. This also comes up with an awesome loading screen, a free emoticon, a glider, some more V-Bucks. And we have also got this emote which is gonna be the Doze Dab. And obviously since the Dab emote was released in Chapter 1, we have got a remaster of it. But on top of that, we have also got an amazing pickaxe to go along with this skin. And how can we forget the awesome night skins from Fortnite Chapter 1? This time, we have got ourselves a new customizable night skin. Which means you will be able to unlock a ton of variants for this skin by customizing her. And the name of the skin is gonna be the Spectra Knight. In order to customize this skin completely and unlock it, you just need to complete a few challenges and with that, you will be able to fully unlock this skin. And obviously this skin also comes up with a lot of free rewards. We have got ourselves a loading screen, a bag bling, an awesome contrail, a spray paint, a pickaxe, a wrap, and also we have got an emote which is the flashback breakdown. We had the breakdown emote which is this one right over here, and now we have got a remaster of it which will be included in the battle pass along with the skin. And let's not forget, we also have some other skins in this battle pass. If you have a look at the loading screen of this skin, you guys can see the awesome Lil Peely skin using a hoverboard and obviously a lot of unvaulted items are also coming back which includes the OG pump, the baller and as well as the hoverboard, the shopping carts and the LMG alongside the planes. And if you're wondering what are the rewards for the Peely skin, well we have got an awesome bunch of lineup. We have got ourselves a loading screen, an awesome pickaxe, a free bag bling, an awesome glider, a free corn trail, some more V-Bucks and obviously the skin itself. And one of the skins which has been teased out in the teaser is gonna be a remix of Cuddle Team Leader and the Raven skin that we can see who is using the shopping cart. And there's actually a lot of things that people actually missed out on this. And before I reveal the map and the extra bonus rewards, I want to tell you guys about the live event that is finally happening. We have missed live events so much and it seems like with the OG Fortnite, we're gonna be getting ourselves a live event 
thanks to Kato Thorne's time machine. Well, the time machine got broken and that's why we're getting the return of the OG season. And it seems like that we are going to be cycling through the chapter 1 seasons for a month with constant map changes and OG weapons coming back into the loot pool alongside some amazing vehicles as well. So far, it hasn't been addressed if the quad crashes are going to be coming back. But hey, since they were really prime on Fortnite Chapter 1, they should definitely be making a return. But this OG season is only going to last for a month and then there is going to be a live event happening. And you have guessed it right, there is going to be a black hole event happening on this new season. And then we're going to get into Chapter 5. But since we are on Chapter 1, let's talk about the new things which are upcoming in this new season. Because with this, we're also going to be seeing the return of traps. We have missed the spike traps for a long time and it seems like the turrets alongside the spike traps, they will be coming back. But some of the traps that could still be making a return are going to be the OG OG traps which were there since day one and then they were removed. So it seems like even they could be coming back but alongside that we have got the OG assault rifle coming back, the chug splashes and as well as there's a really high chance that the Caddis monster could also be making a return. But since we're gonna be getting ourselves the OG map that I'll be revealing in just a few seconds, well, the OG map used to have this dinosaur footprint which was of the Caddis monster. So if the map is coming back, we could most likely be seeing the return of the Caddis monster once again. And if Caddis monster is coming back, we could be seeing a ton of live events happening in this new upcoming season which is Fortnite OG. We have got Jung Junction, Haunted Hills, Snobby Shores, Breezy Grove, Frosty Flights, Flush Factory, Shifty Shafts and as well as Tilted Towers coming back alongside Pleasant Park. And by the way, if you have noticed in this map just a few seconds ago, I talked about the Caddis Monster coming back. If you look at this map over here, you will see that Polar Peak is not mentioned on this map which means the Caddis Monster is still stuck inside the Polar Peak which is yet to be revealed and since we're gonna be seeing a ton of changes in this map we could be seeing the Ice King event happening as well cause well yeah the snow kicked in and since we might be celebrating December Christmas on this map itself we could be seeing a ton of live events but we have got an awesome bunch of locations still gotta have a look out for. Loot Lake will be back so hopefully we get to see Kevin back again. We have got the awesome golf course at Lazy Links. We have got the return of Risky Reels, Wailing Woods, Tomato Temple, Lonely Lodge and how can we forget where the meteor crashed which is at Dusty Divot. We have got Retail Row, Salty Springs coming back, Paradise Palms, Fatal Fields and as well as Lucky Landing. Let me know in the comments down below which spot will you be dropping at and if you enjoyed watching this video then please use code GARU in the item shop and click on this video which is showing up right now because this video is pretty awesome.